Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a PR haul to share with you guys. So all these items were sent to me from different companies. I will let you know which company sent them to me. That way they're weird, there's no confusion. So the first one we have here is from Mint Mongoose. Mint Mongoose is a jewelry subscription service. You can get their jewelry for $12 a month and then you get three pieces of jewelry. They are like very intricate pieces, some of them are, and some of them are very dainty, so it just depends. You can also go on and change your subscription to where you get more pieces added to it so if you want to add more pieces to it each month you can actually do that as well so let's open this up and see what's inside of mine so it does come in this pretty blue packaging which i always love and then it comes in this pretty envelope and it says thank you for all of your help this past year you're beyond appreciated so this is from helena helena is the owner of the company so here is what the package looks like i really love her package because it has this little seal on it the seal reminds me of harry potter for some reason i don't know why but it just does so i pull you can pull that off and then open up your envelope and inside of here you have your jewelry and it's wrapped up into mint packaging whoops i just dropped one so the first thing I see is a ring. This ring is really, really pretty. Oh my gosh, I love this ring. So this ring is like a little silver ring and it looks like it has, I'm not sure, I think it's just a design. At first I thought it was kind of like starfish or something, but I think it's just a design. I don't think it's any in particular. Let me see if I can find my little cutter again so I can cut this open. I always struggle opening these packages. So here's what it looks like. Let me set my cutter down. I don't have my rings on which is great they're in the little thing to be washed so here's what the ring looks like it is actually really really pretty so that is super duper cute i really like that so i love silver like not really silver i love silver too but i also love like the white gold so this would go perfectly with my type of jewelry that i'd usually wear which all of mine's in the cleaner thing i forgot to grab it out when i started filming so the next thing inside of here is it looks like maybe a necklace so actually it's probably good that I don't have any of my jewelry on so I can wear all of this today. So let's cut this open. And then it's all nice and neatly wrapped into packaging and then it's even bubble wrapped to keep it secure. So this is, yes, a little necklace. Oh, this is super cute too. This has got like some little stones to it. So it looks like a ruby and then looks like an opal. Very pretty, nice and shiny. So let's see, let's put this on. And it looks like it's adjustable too so you can adjust it to up to three times it looks like so you can make it longer or shorter whichever prefer whichever you prefer so let's see if i can get this on i always struggle putting my own necklace on i don't know about you guys but i always struggle i'm like i need help putting my necklaces on all right maybe i'll get it on maybe maybe not all right what in the okay i think i got it all right so there it is on my neck i think that is super cute it's just like a very it's got a lot of detail to it but it's not super gaudy i don't like really big chunky pieces i know some people really like that the more what is that called statement jewelry i just don't like that i like more smaller intricate pieces so the next thing in here is it looks like a pair of earrings which i'm not going to try these on because my ears i just started putting my earrings back in my ears were giving me a fit for a while so i didn't wear my earrings for a long time you guys probably noticed in videos i wasn't wearing my earrings but that's because my ears were very tender for some reason it wasn't anything that like the earrings i was wearing it just they were sore i think it's from sleeping on my side all the time but these are really cute they're like little bar earrings so they have these little bar detail here these are actually really cute as well so you could put them as like almost like a crawler going up your ear or you could have them dangling down whichever you prefer so if you guys are interested in mint mongoose i highly recommend them for different smaller pieces she does have more bolder jewelry too like these statement pieces of jewelry so if you're looking for that as well you can get that from her company the next thing i have is from nadine west nadine west is a subscription service where they send you different articles of clothing you can keep what you like you can send back what you don't like i'm actually wearing one of the tops right now this is a nadine west shirt i really like this shirt it's like a velvety style i don't know if it's velvet is it velvet or yeah i guess it's velvet but it feels really really nice and cozy it's more of a crop style so let's see if I can stand up and show you it's a little bit more crop style so I don't know if you were able to see it in the video footage or not my camera screen is not popping up in the back that's why I'm not gonna be able to try any of these pieces on for you guys so unfortunately I can't try them on until I can figure out how to be able to see exactly what I'm doing so that I can see that I'm in focus so we'll show you everything though and tell you the pricing on everything I have the pricing right here for you guys 
So this shirt right here is $26.99. I think that is a fantastic value for the shirt. I love it. I think it's perfect for the winter months because it's nice and cozy and it's still cute. So the next thing I have here is this green one. And this is from Zinnia Premium. This is a size medium. I get all of my shirts in a size medium. This is more like a tunic style shirt and it's got the buttons on the side and it goes up a little bit on the sides here. This is called the Dark Olive Top and it's $30.99. This is a little bit thinner material than what this is. This is obviously a little bit more warmer, a little bit more perfect for winter. I think this one could definitely carry you in through like spring because it's not super heavy weighted. I think you could wear this with a cute little scarf on top and I think that would be super adorable. The next thing is this one here. And this is a blue top and it's got this really pretty crisscross detail in the front. And again, it's more of a tunic style, so it's got the tunic detail to it. This is the Celia Cobalt, it's $30.99. Again, any pieces that you get when you get your Nadine West, you do not have to keep them. You can send any pieces back that you don't like or that don't fit. Anything that's just not your style, you can definitely send back. Then I have this pair of jeggings. These are truly like jeggings because they're like sweatpants material but they look like jeans. These are so darn cute. I think they're adorable. These are Barber Bottoms and these are $19.99. I think these are gonna be perfect for like just lounging around. So it looks like you're actually dressed, but you're not really. You're wearing like kind of like sweatpants. So perfect for the winter. Then I have this really cute sweatshirt dress. So this is a sweatshirt dress. It's definitely a lot longer. It's got pockets on the sides here. This is the Demetra, I'm sorry, did I miss one? Actually, yes, I'm goofed. This is the green top. This is $26.99. This is the Natalie green top. And this is by Zenny Outfitters. This is a small medium. It's going to be a little bit short on me. So what I'm planning to do with it is wear it with a pair of like jeggings. I think it'll be good with that or leggings, whatever you want to call them. So I do like this top though. I think it's super nice for like, it's not really a dress for me because like I said, it comes like right below to my bum and I'm like, that's a little short for me. But it could definitely be dressed with leggings and stuff like that. Then we have this really cute shirt here. This is a burgundy top and it's like sheer and then nice and flowy. And it has the button details on the sleeves. I love the button detail where you can pull it up a little bit. And then in the front, it just has like the V cut. This is the Kai from Los Angeles, Los Angeles. Yes, this is a size medium. This is the Dimitri Burgundy Top for $22.99. I think this is a fantastic deal for this shirt because it's super great for the office. Like if you have an office job, this would be a great blouse to wear to the, to the office. Put on a cute necklace, throw on a cute pair of pants and a pair of heels and you're good to go. So I think that is super nice. Then we have this pair of leggings, jeggings, whatever you call them. I don't even know what people call them. So here's these are, these have like the lacing detail on the side. So this would be great with that green little dress that's like the sweatshirt dress. So here's the lacing detail on the sides. I think these are nice. These are $23.99. So not a bad price for a pair of leggings. These actually fit very nice. And I found out that they're not squat proof. So you definitely want to have like a shirt over top of them that's going to cover your bum because you can see through them. So I do want to point that out because they're not squat proof. You can see through those. The next thing is this really cute shirt. This is from Zinnia. Zinnia. I think it's Zinnia Outfitters again. No, Zinnia Premium. This is a size medium. It's a black shirt with lace details on the sleeves. I really like the black lace detail. Then it's just a nice comfy flowy shirt. So something that, that you can throw on for a casual day. This is the Rosa Black Top. This is $29.49. I do feel like that's a little overpriced for the shirt. But I do think the material feels really nice. I don't think it's cheap material or anything like that. I just think that it's a little overpriced. Then we have this cute shirt here. This one is a gray, like a, almost like a smoke gray. And then it's got the lace detail on the arms. I have seen shirts like this, like at Ross and places, but I do think this one is a little bit better quality. So I will point that out. This is a much better quality than the ones I've seen at Ross. This is Zinnia Premium again. This is $21.99 and that's about the price you're going to pay at Ross. You might pay $15 for it at Ross, but this is get getting delivered to your home. So you got to also remember that. So take that into consideration as well. So this is getting delivered to your home and it's more of a tunic style. So this is just super cute, honestly. Then we have this cute pair of pants here. I really love these. These again are very stretchy. So you can 
definitely like multiple sizes could wear these these are a size medium i'm pretty sure i'm saying that but i'm not positive um yes medium so these are 95 percent polyester and five percent spandex so they do have a lot of stretch to them but these to me would be appropriate for the office because they're more like the straight detail like the pants that you would wear the office pants i think these would be cute with just a little sweater thrown over top and a pair of flats super duper cute then i have this very long dress oh i forgot to tell you the bottoms oh the price of those those are 23.49 so not too bad then we have this really long black dress this one is going to be super duper cute on i tried it on and it's like the only thing i don't like about it is that it has stripes going this way so i feel like it makes my hips look quite a bit larger than they actually are so that's the only thing that i don't like about this but this is made out of like um like thermal material it's like very very nice and cozy so this in the winter months throw this on with a cute cardigan super duper cute and this is the Deidre black stripe dress. It's $35.99. Definitely worth it because it's a very high quality dress for it, in my opinion. I think there's nothing wrong with it. There's no stitching details messed up. Everything looks fantastic on this. And then the last top I have in here is this one right here. Actually, this is a dress. This is like a burnt orange dress, a little flowy dress. Perfect for the spring summer months when you just want something easy to throw on. It does have pockets in it, which I don't know about you guys, but when a dress has pockets, that just makes the dress like a hundred times better. So I really like that it has pockets. This is the Toynet Copper dress and it's $29.99. So I think it's super duper cute. And again, it's the orange color. So I know for sure I will get a lot of use out of it because my son does go to UVA. Actually, he will be graduating from UVA in May. He will be graduating from his master's classes. So that's pretty awesome. So they also have jewelry pieces that they send you. So I'll show you a couple pieces that she sent that I think are super duper cute. This one here is my favorite out of all of them. I'll be honest, just because I think it's, I don't even like statement necklaces, but this one, I don't know why, but this one just really calls to me. It's got the different shades of of uh, metals and it's really heavy made I think this would look really cute with just a like a sweater or even just the shirt I'm wearing right now would look it would look really good with so I really love this necklace I think this one's really nice then the other one that I really loved is this one right here I'll show you uh, here it is I think it's because I like the mixed metals is why I really like these two these are my two favorite pieces so this one here again has the mixed metals so you've got the small different little stones here you've got one gold one silver and one like rose gold and then the smaller chain i really love this piece because it's nice and dainty and it still shows off a little bit of detail to it i like that it has a little bit of detail but not super over the top so anyway those are the items i got from nadine west that i wanted to share with you guys so she did send me everything in there complimentary to just test out basically i love this top this top feels so cozy i love 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 this top the next thing was sent to me from Octoly and Cher. So this is the Cher Eau de Couture perfume. I'm actually wearing it now. I have been wearing it for the past couple weeks. It smells really nice because it's one of those perfumes that smells like florally, but not over the top florally. And I think it could be used for multiple, multiple times of the year. It's not super expensive. I've looked up the pricing and everything. It's not over like, I think it was like $45 for a bottle of this, which is not pricey in my opinion versus some of the others that I've purchased along the lines. I think the bottle to this is very, very pretty. I think that they did a great job designing the bottle. It smells really nice though. So if you're looking for a perfume that's very, not very florally, that's florally, but not over the top florally, it smells florally mixed with powder. You're going to like this because it smells just like that. So thank you so much to Octoly and Cher for sending this perfume. I love it. So the next thing was also sent to me from Octoly and Silwasu. So Lawsu is a higher end brand for skincare and makeup. So this is their perfecting cushion foundation. So I fell in love with this the first time I tried it out. When they sent, when you get the box to this, it does always come with an extra cushion. So you have an extra cushion. It does also come with a little puff so you can use the puff in here, but I actually prefer to use my actual beauty sponge. So I just took my beauty sponge and dipped it into here and put it all over my skin. It doesn't give you full coverage. I would say it's light to medium coverage, but your skin looks so natural and yet it still covers up a good amount of stuff that you need to cover. Like for me, I have a lot of acne issues going on in this area so it does a great job of covering that up so for me this is just a fantastic product because it's not so thick and like emollient so that your face looks like you're wearing a mask 
but it still does a good job of covering so I really really have been enjoying this I think for me I think this would be great for somebody who likes to wear da makeup daily because it's not going to be feeling like you're putting on a mask every day so if you wear makeup on the daily definitely look into the Silwasu brand because I feel like they have a good thing going for makeup I think the makeup looks so natural onto your skin so thank you so much to Silwasu and Octoly for sending this to me to test out the next thing I have is from Fresh. So I have not tested these out yet, but I can tell you that I've tried lots of things from Fresh and Fresh is a very good skincare line, but we'll go ahead and get into these right now. So we have the Fresh Lotus Youth Pre Preserve Eye Cream. So for me, I'm always on the lookout for an eye cream that's not too thick and it's not too thin. So it has to be enough to where it gives you hydration, but not so thick that you end up getting those little mealy bumps under your eyes. I hate that. So Fresh and Octoly did send me these complimentary, like I said. So I'm going to be testing these out and then I'll let you guys know once I've tested them completely how well these work. I'm going to, it doesn't have a scent to it, which is really nice because I don't like for my skincare to have much of a scent to them. So the jar looks really nice and luxurious. It's glass. So it does have a seal in here to let you know once you broke that seal that you opened it up. So it's a nice luxurious product that's not over the top pricing so fresh to me is like that midline pricing but yet their skincare is very very good so then we have the fresh lotus youth preserve dream face cream so this is a night recovery cream so if you're someone who's like me and you have very dry skin you should definitely be putting on a thicker night cream in the evening because that's going to help you in the daytime so that your skin's not so dry when you're putting your makeup on and you don't end up looking like the Sahara Desert and everything cracking open. So this comes in this beautiful blue bottle. Again, it has the seal to let you know that it has not been opened yet. So once I crack it, then you have opened the jar, obviously. Again, if this has a very slight scent to it, but nothing major, it's more just like, smells like lotion, basically, like a facial cream. So I am excited, like I said, about trying all of these out. Then we have the Fresh Lotus Youth Preserve Moisturizer. So this is your day cream. So this one here you would use in the day daytime because it's not going to be as thick for your skin. It's going to give your skin the protection as well as the moisturization it needs without feeling so goopy onto your skin and making your makeup flip and slot around. So this one here looks like that. Again, the jar had the little seal, which I just broke. I forgot to show you. So and again, it's got the little safety seal up here. And this one doesn't smell like much of anything either. It's got a little bit of a lotion smell to it, but other than that, that is it. And these all come in nice glass jars. All these jars are nice and solid. So if you have, be careful, if you have, I have a marble sink and I dropped a glass jar in one of our marble sinks one time and it broke the sink. It didn't break the jar, it broke the sink. So be careful with these in your bathroom. So thank you so much to Fresh and Octoly for sending me those for to review. I do have some other things from Octoly that have sent, they have sent to me recently, but I'm going to be testing those out a little bit further and I want to do an in-depth video on one of those items because I want to show you how it actually works. So I do have two more items I want to share with you, but they will be coming up later on. So anyway, I, that is my PR haul. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Let me know if you've tried any of these products before. Let me know what do you think of Nadine West as well as for Mint Mongoose. I am so appreciative to get all these products sent to me so I can test them out and let you guys know the good, bad, and the ugly of everything. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, I'll catch you guys later.